With this one command, I can hijack the display of this router. Cool, right? So after I bought this router and thought, why not see what's inside? And I found it really interesting that this pocket router has a small LCD display. So after I opened it up, I found RX and TX pad, which is basically for UART communication. And I soldered some wires. Next, serial connection with FTDI USB to TTL. Totally necessary, or so I thought. Turns out the Type-C port had ADB enabled. Also, the bootloader was unlocked and I was able to install custom bootloader. Also, I was able to disable the SE Linux. And this topic alone deserves a full detailed video on it. And after going through the system's configuration files and binaries, I figured out the system was running some version of Android. And surprise, 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 I can run Java code here. At first, I wrote some code just to display a simple image. I had to install a specific version of Android SDK on my system. And after some failed attempts, I was finally able to compile the code and run it on the router. I'm still trying to understand the system better and definitely the next goal is to play Doom on it. And if you don't want to miss it, definitely follow and join our Discord.